That's why it's important that you learn at least one or two support champions. Don't ruin other people's games just because you're a mid laner that's been auto-filled to support. Now that is some high quality support gameplay right there. Allow me to educate you guys on how a support should play to win, with the wisdom that I'm about to share with you. This will definitely turn you from a typical support, to an alpha support. With the cutting edge 3D modeling technology that the production team have, let me show you how you should be playing as a support. What you are seeing right now, is a typical high low ranked game scenario. Look at that detail. Demo high quality particles. That fine ragdoll physics integration. Now, a normal bot lane goes like this. Your marksman farms the enemy minions while you, the support, protects him from the threats that the enemy marksman and the enemy support might get of this poor specimen. But an alpha support does not go with the flow of the typical bot lane game. An alpha support decides what the flow of the bot lane game should be. It starts with a proper champion pick, and then you... If you follow all these steps, your bot lane will turn from this, to this. I'm aware that these methods greatly contradicts the previous video about being a considerate player. Well, like the media, this channel is highly known for its lies and hypocrisy. But you know what they say. Only the truth comes out of the mouth of a lying hypocrite.
that feel when Yogg-Saroth supports KDA is better than Yogg-Saroth mids KDA. Just so you know, KDA does not determine who carries the game, because after watching the game, I'm sure you guys know who carried that last game. Well, fuck you.